I'm Tyler Druitz, and I'm super excited to share with you guys this Alpha Season 3 launch of Atari Sunnyvale. Atari has been innovating and pushing the boundaries of what can be done through technology and gaming going back to the 70s and 80s with new consoles, new games, and we're trying to do that with new technologies. We've partnered with The Sandbox to bring that experience to everyone. We launched Atari X as a way to build a community around Web3 and blockchain and new technologies. We wanted to bring everything into one place where we can engage with that community, hear what they have to say, and be able to react and build what the community wants. Atari Sunnyvale in the Sandbox is truly a social hub. You can experience your classic favorites reimagined and built into this absolutely immersive experience. We're really excited to bring some of our top games such as Adventure, Centipede, Sword Quest, Missile Command, Pong, to that experience. With immersive games, we'll actually be able to play Crystal Castles in the Sandbox experience and see it in a whole new way. My favorite part is when you can stand on top of the Fuji logo at the center of the map and look out and see all of the different games that have been brought into this map. From there, you can jump down and follow the track from one game to the next. You'll be able to see a Missile Command rocket and go down into a Missile Command launch room. Then there's even some tricks and Easter eggs that are scattered around. In talking to the community, I think people are excited to see the different builds for sure, but also to complete all of the quests. We're bringing the fun back with these games. You're gonna be able to see them in a whole new light and it almost feels tangible in the sandbox. I love the voxel art for them because it kind of goes back to the retro 8-bit of the 2600 or arcade games. So it feels like Atari felt back in the 70s, but in a whole new way. I think everybody's gonna love this experience, whether you are a new fan, an old fan, a gamer, a builder, or just somebody who wants to discover the metaverse and see what's possible. It could be fun for everyone. If you've seen the map, you know we have a lot of real estate out there. So this is really just the beginning.